Mark Zuckerman, massesports.com. Hey guys, congrats. Uh, I know this is all the first time for you. So what was just sort of the first emotions when you got the word earlier? Go in and any order you want. Uh, uh, you know, it was, it was cool. Uh, definitely a, uh, you know, it, it's something that whenever you are a baseball player, it's something that uh, you hope that uh, you participate in and uh, you are holding yourselves to standards and uh, the other players around you and uh, fans around think that you deserve uh, to be in this game. So it's uh, definitely pretty cool. Uh, it's a great feeling and I'm very excited. Go ahead. Um, yeah, no, what Kyle said, I think, you know, it's a game that you watch on TV as a little kid. Um, you kind of dream of playing in and um, get a chance to get voted in, whether it's by fans or players or, um, you know, commission office, whoever, you know, whoever does it. I think just to be a part of it is special and, um, you know, something that we won't forget and we'll try to, you know, cherish, cherish for the rest of our lives and um, try to soak it all in when, when we go. Uh, it's like this guy just say that uh, it's like a dream for every player to just come to the All-Star game to be around uh, all those stars and famous people. It's just, it just going to be a great experience to be out there and have fun with all those guys. Um, for Kyle, will you still be able to attend? And does that make this bittersweet that you're not going to be able to actually play in the game? Yeah, I mean, I, you know, I, I think I'm, you know, I'd like to go and uh, still kind of experience everything. You know, it's, you only get one first. And, uh, you know, so I'm gonna, I wanna experience it and, um, you know, just, just make the most of it. You know, it sucks I won't be able to play, but uh, you know what, uh, it is what it is, but I, I'm, I'm still very excited to be a part of it. Maria Torres, The Athletic. What about the festivities are you guys looking forward to? I don't think we have any idea what they are, so uh, we'll, we'll find out. We'll let you know when we know, but uh, I don't think, I mean, I don't know. I'm sure these guys might be in the same boat as me. As, uh, we, we don't know, but we're, uh, we're excited. Yeah. Let's see. Let's see what, you want to you wanna see anything like home run derby? I mean, I want to watch everything. I'm going to try to enjoy every moment of, of the game, uh, game, home run derby, everything. I'm just going to try to enjoy it. Try to record as much as I can and save it for the future. Yeah, same here. Uh, you know, whatever the the experience, the activities are, experiences, and you know, we'll take them in. Uh, you know, definitely want to see the home run derby, especially their course. See how see how far some of these guys are going to be hitting some baseballs. You know, like Shohei Otani, things like uh, you know, Vladdy. These guys are going to be going out there and putting on a show, so that'll be fun. And then this experience the game too. I think it's going to be great. Kyle, well, um, did you get to do any like all-star stuff when you were at the home run derby or were you just kind of limited to just that? Yeah, I was just kind of like that weird guy in the corner just sitting there waiting for uh, for the, 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 the time slot to come up and then it's like, hey, get out. You know what I mean? But no, I'm kidding. They, they, treated, they treated everyone great. You know, uh, even if you're, you know, you, you're participating in a home run derby and you're not technically an all-star, you know, they treated you just like uh, you were an all-star. And uh, you, you got everything, you know, you're in a BP group, you're in everything else. And then until it was, uh, you know, game time, you know, you're, you're, you're out. Jesse Docker, do you watch post? Hey guys, uh, congrats. I, you, to have three all-stars in the same lineup is, is no joke. So I know Kyle's obviously, you know, not in the lineup right now and Trey, you're a bit banged up. What do you guys think it says about the potential of what this group could do in the second half? fact that obviously three in the same order are being recognized with this kind of honor. Yeah, I just think it's what we've, we've been doing. You know, you saw the last you know month or so what we're capable of as a team. Uh, we've been playing good baseball. You know, we hit a little rough patch here. I think, um, you know, it's part of running into a really good team, part of just, you know, a lot of injuries at, at the same time, which is, you know, kind of unfortunate. So we hit a little bit of a speed bump, but you know, hopefully we can get a lot of guys back uh, and get back to where we were. But I think, you know, you saw in the last month what, you know, us three and, and you know, everyone else is capable of and what we can do as a team. So, uh, you know, it's fun when we're all clicking and all playing together. And, 
you know, we got a lot of baseball left and you got to keep going. I don't know. Anybody else has thoughts on that? Um, I'll go if you don't. Yeah, thoughts. <laughs> I don't know, man. I think it's gonna be it's gonna be fun the second half. Uh, when whenever we get these guys back in the lineup, healthy, and our guys that are hurt, our pitching and everything, I think it's gonna be great. Uh, I think we're gonna be good in the second half. We're gonna have fun, like he says. When we all click together, we we coming in hot. So I think. It's gonna be fun. Uh, it's gonna be kind of a challenge too because we gotta keep going and keep playing baseball, try to win this this East, and yeah, we will see. And Trey, um, I know we're still a week out, but do you expect to have any sort of like uncertainty with the finger if you'll be able to actually participate, or are you kind of not quite there yet? Um, I don't know yet. I think uh, hopefully I'll be able to play in some capacity. I mean, I, I want to. Um, yep. But uh, like you know, like we're doing, take it day by day and see how it feels. And um, you know, I'd love to play play the game. Thanks, man. Savannah McCann, LB.com. Hey guys, congrats! Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay, perfect. These headphones aren't very good. I don't know when you're allowed to start telling people with the embargo rule if you're allowed to already. But have you been able to tell anybody, or when you are able, who will be the first person that you reach out to and let them know that you've been elected to your first All Star game? Yeah, um, you know, I, I, I let my wife, my family know, but, uh, you know, just to keep it on the wraps because not until, uh, you know, everything gets released, but, uh, you know, it, it's, it's an exciting moment where whenever you do get told, it, it's something that uh, you're excited about and you want to let your family know about because uh, they're the ones that have helped you along the way. You know, this isn't a, a one-man job, uh, you know, you, I'm sure, you know, Trey can speak to it too, his wife uh, being there anchoring down the, the home front and uh, your family too, from your upbringing to uh, get you to where you were to be able to be a professional baseball player. So um, I'm sure it's more of, a, it's, it's just a, the same as thrill for them as it is for us. Uh, I think just my family first, uh, I always tell my family, they, they've been, Great right there. They've been pushing for me the whole way. They've been voting. They've been telling people. They, it just, it just crazy how, how, how good they, they try to make me do it the All Star. So I just tell them, let them know they make, we make it, and I hope they enjoy it too. So that's, that's my first person that I told. Yeah, I'm with them. I told my, my wife and my parents. Um, you know, try to tell a few people because. Who knows you can trust with social media, but, uh, you know, I think, you know, my mom and my, uh, my wife were really excited about it and probably wanted it more than, you know, I did. And so it was, it's cool getting to tell, you know, those people around you that you made it. Cause, um, like Kyle was saying, and Juan was saying they have, a, you know, they have a partner and they, they helped you get there and, um, you know, it makes them excited and, and, uh, you know, to put that smile on their face, just as much as your own face is, is nice. All right, uh, Mark Zuckerman, massesports.com. Uh, any of you who have the strongest feeling on this can feel free to chime in. Are you surprised that Max isn't in that room with you right now, given the first half that he had? Yeah, if he's not an all-star, there's something wrong. I mean, <laughs> we, I mean, we pulled up the stats when we found out, and I, don't, I mean, I know there's a lot of good players. I get it, but, I mean, he's top five in every category, <laughs> and not only just like the NL, but mostly the MLB as well. So. Um, I just thought they didn't notify pitchers today or something because <laughs> that's the only thing that would make sense to me is if they just didn't tell pitchers today and they're telling them tomorrow or something. But I think he's more than deserving. And, you know, these guys, I think, would agree that he's got the numbers. He's, you know, he's Max Scherzer, and I think he deserves to be there. Yeah, same thing, same way. I just I just see a guy like that that competes and put the numbers every year. It just, it just crazy to don't see him. And the All Star, uh, he just <laughs> like he say, he's just crazy, man. He been there every time. He come play every day, so it just he just tough to see him out out of there. Yeah. And we'll finish up with Maria Torres, the Athletic. He's gonna go with you guys. Huh? Uh, who's gonna come with us to the game? 
and everything. No, I haven't reached that far yet. <laughs> I haven't thought that far in advance. It's fine. So we'll, I mean, we'll see. I'm going to take a guess and say my wife, my kid, and my parents and my, yeah. my parents-in-law. But after that, who, who knows? I mean, I think uh, Juan's probably got a couple, a couple people <laughs> to invite, but he'll be all right. <laughs> no, I'm fine. I just, I don't have wives and kids. I, I just take him mom, that brother and sister. So that's all the guys that go with me. Yeah, we'll see what's going on with me since I'm not really participating. I'm just watching. So uh, you got your brothers. Yeah, I got the, I got the guys. <laughs> probably, my wife will probably come and talk to my parents, see if they want to do anything. All right. Thanks, everybody. Congrats, guys. And like you said, uh, show's at 530 tonight.